The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied by Yuri, and from China, weighing in at 200. Guys, we have a big time tag pounds, team match coming up here. Akira. A big time match with big time stakes, Michael. Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. And his partner, from Owita, Japan, weighing in at 238 pounds, Rage. Byron, how big is this match for these two teams here tonight? Well, Michael, the tag team division is white hot right now. So while a win will obviously be huge, I can tell you that a loss would be absolutely devastating. Given the competition right now, a loss tonight would be a huge setback. This is going to be fun. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 650 pounds, Otis Dozovic and Tucker Nye. Heavy Machinery. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. Oof. We're ready to go. And whichever team wins this match here tonight can absolutely oh. make an argument for being one of WWE's top teams. Oh, nasty impact. Harsh impact. What a splash! taking some offense. This tag team match can get out of hand Ouch. quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It's oh. no secret that quick tags lead to success in the tag team division. And I'd say the quicker he can make that tag here, the better their chances of winning will be. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of the tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live, I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, The New Day, The Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus, I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. This might be it! Oh, my! 
Larian. Boom. He's on the defensive here. Now he may have to start reevaluating his game plan. It looks to me like he's really trying to carry this team on his back, which really isn't necessary considering he has a very capable oh, partner he could tag in here. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. There's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Not good for the back and body. Right in the mouth. Oh, Relent. Oh, oh, come on. How can this be legal? This could lead to a disqualification quick. Oh, the dreaded claw to the oh, shoulder. man. A long way down. We're gonna see here. Hung up on the second row. Beautiful technique. He's not looking like himself here. I don't think he expected to be in this position here. Well, it's not dire consequences for him here, which is good. But just in case, he might want to think about getting his partner in there for a bit. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. Look at Otis Dozovic. But is it enough to end it? Guys, Dozovic might have this one sewn up. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Flying forearm. He's starting to feel it here. He looks incredibly motivated, though. Don't expect him to be down for long. It's decision time, Cole. Does he try to get back on the offensive himself, or does he attempt to make a tag here? Reverses that one. He's looking a little off balance. His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. If you told me heading into this match that he was going to absorb so much punishment, I would have called you a liar. Especially you, Saxton. But then again, I never believe anything that comes out of your mouth. A very crucial part of the match for him here. He simply cannot let his opponent gain too much momentum. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the end may be near. Oh, he might just win this thing right here. Cover here. A two out of three falls match. You saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus. It was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a broke kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss Cyborg. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down and the third fall was ruled a double countout. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. We're gonna see here. Hung up on the second row. Going all the way up. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Heart Foundation. The rocker dropper from the Rockers. He might have it. He's making a statement here with this attack. Boom, what impact. Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. 
In tag team action, like in singles competition, once a duo nails their opponent with their finisher, that should signal the beginning of the end. It can take a long time for a tag team to decide on a double team finisher, but I agree. A team needs one, and it should be something that can be... Tucker Knight is in position. Over. To think, I almost rode him off or got the shoulders down. Two! A kick out. This one's not over yet. Not yet. Oh, look at the elbow after. Looking for the finish. Tucker Knight is in position. Yeah, double arm lock song. But I don't know how much gas he has. His shoulders are down! Two! Three! They did it! And here's another glance at these superstars in action. He's getting it done here. Oh, I can't believe this. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. And here's a last look at this one. Here are your winners, Otis Dozovic and Tucker Knight, Heavy Machinery. That's it for this.